excellent leaders uh, throughout time have all understood that the quality of the dialogue around the leadership table is really important and that they need that dialogue to be lifted, that dialogue, that conversation has to be at a high level. So you need people around the table who are prepared to inject into the conversation new and different and dissenting uh, opinions. If the organization shuts that down, if the organization cannot tolerate the creative tension, the constructive friction, that kind of collision of, of differing points of view, then it's not going to be a great organization. So the chief executive officer should play an active role as the chief agitator in ensuring that the dialogue is kept sharp and at a high level. And I don't care if they've got to lob in grenades to stir people up, you don't want complacency. You don't want comfortable. You want an executive team, you want management teams, you want people who understand that friction, disagreement, dissent is a positive, it's a lubricant, it's a fuel for better. You have to create the environment in which that is possible. Not easy to do, which is maybe why not a lot of people do it, but the rules have changed. And you've got to ask yourself every single day, what is the responsibility that I have as a leader to put my company, to put my organization in a winning space? And it's not about last quarter's numbers. It's not about next quarter's share price. It's about, am I doing what I need to do as a leader to put my company in the best possible opportunity space, in the best possible position to seize opportunities. Let me tell you one other thing here, because I think we got the math wrong on this. If a leader in an organization wants to talk about share of market, I can tell you that conversation is going to lead them into a grave. You should not be focused on share of market. You should be focused on a new metric. Let's call it share of opportunity. If you are growing your share of opportunity, you will be a healthy company. If you are fighting over share of market, you will not be successful in the long run.